The future is now on the Lower East Side, where biometric scanning is providing added security and convenience for some people. Antoine Lewis shows us how it all works. To enter Building B at Knickerbocker Village, you don't need your key card. Your face will do just fine, courtesy of a new biometric security system called FST-21. Our old system used to have a card. If you lose a card, we have to charge you for a new card. If you forget your card, you can't get in the building. It's kind of hard not to forget your face. Here's how it works. This camera takes five pictures of each resident's face. One is selected, then it and other info about the resident is stored in the system database. Once a tenant tries to get through their building security door, a high-tech scanner reads their face. If recognized by the system, the door is unlocked in a matter of seconds. The FST-21 system is the brainchild of Israeli General Aharon Farkash, who says it strikes the right balance between safety and simplicity. We believe this is a solution for commercial buildings and uh, uh, residential buildings, for uh, airports, in every place that, that uh, you need security and you need the convenience, I believe this is the right place to be installed. Farkash says the system is secure because the database is self-contained to the entity using it. Still, some security experts like Jonathan Gilliam worry about cyber threats. You're looking in one direction and somebody else will come up with a better way to go around your security. So that's really the downfall of any of these biometric systems is that they're linked in with a computer. While initially nervous, Knickerbocker resident Emerson Corres is now a fan. You just look at it and then you're in. So no keys, the only, I hope they do that to open your own doors in your apartment. That would be great. From lower Manhattan, Antoine Lewis, Fox 5 News.